Uh, gonna have to reset my thing. Hold on. There, my voice should sound significantly better now. <laughs> It should be good. All right. Whoa, that was that was a video game sound. More Zaldo time. I'm playing this by ear. Right, this music. This is good music. This game's got a good soundtrack. Alright, uh, let me know if everything's okay. Slash, slash. If everything's alright. Yeah, a lot of people talking about the Cuphead video. It's it's not a, that unusual that, uh... People are, people are like, Whoa, I was just watching that and now you're streaming. I stream pretty often. It's not that crazy of a thing. Oh my. Oh my. Just get out of my face, man. Holy fuck, that was brutal. Cheese. Absolute cheese moment. Put the mic a little further away from my mouth, just a tiny bit. Wow, I actually got a heart from a bush. Can't remember the last time I did that. Why am I doing this? This always ends in tears. It always ends with me running around getting chased by a bee. Oh, that's a lot of subscribers in a row, for some reason. Thank you. Oh, I just got a fairy, I think. And I got a bomb on the very last one. Sick. So where am I going? Hold on. I need to go up the mountain, right? It's like right here. Yeah. I said that in my first playthrough of this, I got stuck on the mountain, but it was after this point. I think I had the Master Sword at that point. Probably? This is not the way. I'm getting the... the red orb of thing. Of destiny. Oh shit. No, oh, I'm a fool. This is not anywhere near where it is. Yup, 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 yup. You know what I ate a million of today? Uh, dried apples. Fuck, I forgot those guys are zappy. I I'm addicted to dried apples. Oh, I've got a, uh, I've got the power glove. Oh, there's a crab under there. I, I ate way too many and I'm wondering... I, I think it's still gonna make me shit a bunch, unfortunately. I think the, the juicy part of fruit- oh, hello. I accidentally slashed his mustache. The juicy part of fruit is, is not the part that makes you poop. It's the stuff in the fruit. I don't know who you are, but if you're gonna go up the mountain, will you take me with you? I lost my lamp. Oh. Okay. Uh, someone says, I've recently started eating the entire apple. I, I used to do that. I don't anymore. I don't think there's anything that's like, I, I don't want to like, condemn anyone to a uh, cyanide-fueled death, because there's always that urban legend that certain, I mean, I think it's like apricot pits and like peach pits have cyanide in them. But it's always like, oh, don't eat the seeds, it'll grow in your stomach or whatever. But I've eaten a shit ton of like, pear and apple pits, and uh, nothing happened. Watch, you step there, are holes in the ground, could you turn right here? Are you also going to the mountain to look for the golden power? Okay. Okay. Bro. Uh, so when he said turn right here, I guess he meant down here, huh? Okay! What a jackass. Oh my. 
there isn't enough cyanide in apples to kill. Well, there you go. Turn right here. Hmm. Oh, he's the grandfather, or the father of one of the maidens. I already don't remember. That, that sentence said whether or not it's like the granddaughter or just daughter. Already forgot. Ooh. I remember this. I remember being annoyed here. Yes, okay. Well. <laughs> I know I died a couple times last stream. He just falls over and eats shit. <laughs> he just falls right on his face. Oh, you start right here. Wow. Why do I start right here? What? That was weird. I guess it saved when I talked to the old man. I thought whenever you died it said, Do you want to go to your sanctuary or what? Snakes. Snakes, why did it have to be snakes? Oh, they're rock snakes, too. Oh god, look at the lag. Mm. Mm. The missing maidens are still alive somewhere. I believe that a hero will rescue them. Hype train! Oh, sorry. Hmm. I wait for that day. Uh. Anyway, thank you for your kindness to an old man like me. Oh, uh, I wanted to give you this. In Japanese, he goes, Eto. That's like Japanese um, isn't it? Eto. Something like that, or E. Which is really E. If you wander into a magical transporter, gaze into. Oh, this is the mirror. Maybe this is where I got stuck. Because I remember it was pretty soon after I got the mirror. Another world. Oh, please. Please. I couldn't move. While he was walking in slowly, I couldn't move. And then it suddenly gave me control back, and I sprinted into a boulder. The wizard has deceived the king, and now he's trying to open the way to the... Okay, Dark World, we can look at your quest, you'll need the Moon Pearl, which is in the tower on top of the mountain. All I can do now is comfort your weariness. Oh, thank God. I hate that beep so much. Okay. Well... I have never played Golden Sun, no. Is that an RPG? I actually know very little about Golden Sun. All I know is that Isaac makes a big hand. Big hand! And we, also, we always used to say hand job when he showed up in, uh, in Brawl. Now I'm gonna take the time to explain that joke. Now, because he has a big, a big hand, he comes in and it's like, uh, it's, it's like the sexual intercourse act where you use your hand to masturbate a penis. And it's because he's a big, big hand. You know, do you get it? I'm gl okay. I think everybody gets it now. Okay, where am I? Who am I? Uh, okay, I guess I want to go left. Let's just check it out. Go check it out! Go check it out. That is a The Shining reference. That cave was not on the map. I'm uh, pretty sure. Maybe it was. I don't know. These keys are really starting to get on my keister. Wow. I just love how pots are like the most powerful object in the universe in this game. They get obliterated. Ah, oh. Okay. I don't recognize this, so this... Maybe this is the right path. We, we might be right at the part where I got stuck. So I remember I used the mirror. I got... I turned into a rabbit. Oh, shit. Yeah, I've played, uh, oh, look at this, though. Did I already go down there? Is that the cave that I entered in? I think it is. Mm. Yeah, I've, I love the Mario and Luigi games. I played the first three.
But two people just asked, yeah. Weird. After their creator's demise, I don't think they died. Actually, maybe that's not what demise means. Uh, so I'm gonna, I guess, get out the mirror. Turn myself into a damn rabbit. Oh. Isn't that what happens? Something like that? Oh. Okay. Nope, I have not played Dream Team. Nor have I played Paper Jam. I played the Ridge Tridge. As they say. They say that. Yes. It's weird that there's not stuff in the pots, it's under the pots. Are these pots just spittoons, then? There's never actually anything in there. Okay, well, I guess I'll go back over here. I guess I'll go up. This is also not on the map, right? What is up with this? It's all weird on the map. It doesn't... Mm. Okay. Heart piece. Heart container piece up there. Is this a liftable rock? No. Okay, so I think I need the... Is this... Is this one... Does this one have, like, the feather? Or whatever that was in, like, Link's Awakening where you can jump mid, like, Pegasus boots? Ah, this! This I recall. It's got, like, a Star of David sort of formation here. Look at this. I know they like their triangles, but look at that. Now, Rabbit. You sound kind of bit crushed. Uh, try resetting the stream. I'm... I'm Bunny. I'm funny. Oh, and I can use the mirror to go back. Right, and it like puts a weird portal down. I remember this. Okay, so I'm gonna turn into Bunny and go search around. Rock's Feather is not in this game. Hmm. Is anyone else hearing me all bit crushed? Oh, I remember this. These guys are chill, right? I think these guys are chill, yeah. Who are you, Mr. Buddy? This world's like the real world, but evil has twisted it. We're in Magic Hand. The golden power is what changed your shape to reflect what's in your heart and mind. <laughs> Do you mean to tell me that Pink Link is a furry? Canonically. I'm always changing my mind, so I turned into a ball. But if you have a ball called the Moon Pearl, you can keep your original shape here. I see. And then I can, like, do stuff. What do you want? Do you have something to say to me, silly rabbit? I came here to get the power of gold, but now I'm a freak and I can't go back to the real world. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Moon pearl, moon pearl. Get the moon pearl. Back off. Shoo, shoo. Alright, so this is right around where I got stuck, actually. I was incorrect earlier. Isn't this Death Mountain? Isn't that like a whole thing about how like Death Mountain is in every game? I think maybe this whole structure is Death Mountain. But it's like specifically the shape of like the two lumps next to each other shows up. Oh, I, l I remember this lava. It moves faster if you're moving up and down. <laughs> That's fun. That's just fun. It was your sound system being cringe. Oh shit, no, I didn't mean to do that. No, fuck. I, I constantly fumble the controls in this game. Actually, does this send me back? Yes. Okay. I... I never get the hang of the controls in this game. So we are soon approaching the point where I have not seen anything after this. Spectacle Rock, right. It has a name. This must be a, like a bridge later, right? This, maybe it's like in the in the light world. It's a bridge. Hmm. Well, I guess I can always just go back if I change my mind. So let's check it out. Go check it out. Oh. Cool. <laughs> oh. 
Okay. So if I get stuck again, I will ask for help. Because I, that's what like made me drop the game initially, was I was like, I don't, I don't know what to do. <laughs> I can't get anywhere. Oh, hello, fairy. I will soothe your says. I've said that about ten times now. Hmm. The bunny hood? Somebody says he was a rabbit in Link to the Past. Which I'm slightly confused because that's the game we're playing, but I, I assume you mean, uh. Assume, well, okay. You mean they're talking about two different things. Let me go down here. Shit. I don't even know, like. Mm. Hmm. Let's just poke around, I guess. Okay, cool zone. But the bunny hood was in... Was that in Ocarina and Majora? Or was it just Majora? So I can't get across that bridge. I mean, I don't have any items that would help with that, right? No. Both? Okay. Might have only ever got it in Majora. Maybe that's just what I remember, because, like, masks and shit. Ba, 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 ba. I mean, wasn't it established in Twilight Princess that he, he has a wolf Sona? See, but this is... what the fuck? What is that? Is that the tower? It's right there. So how the fuck do I get up there? Like, hop down here, maybe? Ooh, look at that. Is that something? Chat, do I go down here? I'm gonna take a drink of water. How high can you jump? None. No jump. Yes, yes, try it. Okay. Oh, sure. Oh, look at this. Yeah, I don't think I ever found this. I think this is new. Oh my god. Actually, I definitely recognize this. Uh... So I'm gonna do this. Maybe I can activate this. Alright, don't you get like a hammer? There's a hammer, right? Hold on. What the fuck do I do? <laughs> I don't know what to do. This is exactly how I felt the first time I played this. A mirror here? This is exactly where I was. And now we're back here. Is it like, can I go up there now? I don't understand. It, like, was this cave here before? We'll try this cave. Because I don't fucking know. I think this is- no, I- this is the thing I already saw. What the fuck? I don't get it. Someone said step on the thing and get double bunny. Yay, hooray. Oh, I see what, okay, I see what to do here. That's what these like holes are. That's dumb, I had to, I had to get some pretty fucking significant hints from chat to figure that out. I don't know if I would have ever put that together. Oy vey, that doesn't make any fucking sense, wait! That do, I thought I was gonna be inside it, in a cave. That doesn't make any fucking sense! No, I take it all back and none of that made sense! I'm like way higher up! I should be in solid rock right now! Whatever. 
It's like fantasy rules. I, okay, that's clearly the thing that I was like stuck with in the past. So now we're past the point. Because I need to have like a brain aneurysm to, play, to figure that out. No, there was this, the like, there's like spaces on the ground were kind of a hint. But that made no sense. It, if I'm moving to the same place in the dark world, I should have been inside Spectacle Rock. Should have been like in solid stone. Oh, hammer, okay. The geography is not one to one, yes. <laughs> It's just the, like, modified 2D, or, yeah, modified 2D thing. Okay. Well, I think this is possibly something I have never done before. This whole Switch mechanic is giving me flashbacks to Link's Awakening, which I know was after this, but... Oh, God. You know what? Maybe I played this part, because there's this annoying worm boss, right? That knocks you off, and then you fall down, and you have to climb all the way back up to try to fight him? And he doesn't actually do damage? Isn't that a thing in this one? I think I do remember this. So I must have somehow figured that out, the whole spectacle rock thing. Okay, I, hmm. Unless this was, there was like an identical thing in Link's Awakening. I use my bunny jumps to go up as I teleport. <laughs> okay, and you have to like use your boomerang. There was, uh, yeah, there was another, there was a sand, there was a worm boss earlier, yeah, that's right. Okay, um, was there anything in here that I could, like, boomerang the switch and, like, get any pog stuff? No, because there's just a switch sitting in here. Anything pog? Literally the same boss in everything, really. Okay, maybe that is what I remember then, because I, I don't- I really don't remember that Spectacle Rock puzzle, or solving that. So maybe I'm just remembering it from, uh, Link's Awakening. Okay. They are not receptive to boomeranging. It chumps, though. All the enemies with shields are the ones that really annoy me in- in these top-down Zeldas. Fall. He's like a weird octo rock. He's like he's like vacuuming the floor with his nose. Like, thop, 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 thop. Mm, delicious floor juice. <laughs> sound effect reminds me of a sound effect in the Avatar: The Last Airbender Game Boy Advance game. I can't swing my sword. Okay, that was weird. I guess when you're in a doorway, you can't swing your sword away. Oh god. Not a brain puzzle. Um, can I... Hey, it's locked. Hey, Luigi? Wait, what even is the point of this, then? I can just walk right up to the door. Okay, well... <laughs> or maybe it's to... Oh, maybe it's like to fall down like a, a layer to a specific spot. But I don't know. Says that it does that every time. Oh, shit. Glubus? Someone said it's Glubus. Right. Adorable. Can I murder it? Thanks. Pre-recorded, yeah. One key. I do have 666 money. Oh, shit. Oh, more of this. Lovely. Clearly they thought this was an amazing idea. Oh, I just need to go hit this. Yeet. Oh, but do I need to wait for them all to be done? Eight. Now it is no longer eight. <laughs> I get murdered by the floor. I'm not a floor master. 
Oi, vai. Give me some hearts. Oh. Give me the beat boys. It looks like a space invader. Anyone else see that? Alright, I'm gonna murder these guys while they're easily murderable. Get them. Eh, maybe this won't even be that easy, actually, because they're bouncing all over the damn place. Give me death. Give me your death, I should clarify. Hmm. Yeah, I, I saw the other messages before, sorry. Somebody decided that, uh, because I didn't react to the ten messages saying that I can hit the tiles with my sword, that they should say it like a jackass. Don't worry. <laughs> uh, this is definitely a puzzle, right? What the fuck? What the hell happened to, uh... The normal puzzle solve jingle. Like earlier, the switches were having the da -da 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 -da, and then I actually solved the puzzle and it went. Bop -bop huh? Bop -bop that sound effect is like verbatim used in the fucking like Avatar game. Also, is this a secret? Hold on. No. I thought maybe because there's like an indentation for doors there, you know? My chair has been going ham lately with the noises. Sometimes it'll just be like, and I'm like, thank you. Fruit! It is I, Sarasasasa. I have some advice. In the dungeons, you can gaze into the magic mirror to return to the entrance at any time. Oh. Is that what that shit in Luigi's Mansion is referring to? Where you, like, look at the mirror and take a picture? And you get sent back to the beginning? Also, that did not help me. I hate the low health beep. How did they think that was a good idea? How? I genuinely want to know how they thought that that was... Anything but annoying. See, like, okay, I can't throw my boomerang up there. Gotta go back and hit the switch. Oh, God damn it. Wow, I didn't think that was gonna hit me. Alright, well, <laughs> I love that he just eats shit when he dies. Oh, oh. <laughs> he just like, he turns on his heel and goes, Boof. <laughs> okay, so the only other place to go is the holes over here. Keep going through doors, the beeping stops? Huh? Oh, why did I do that? I'm locked in now. So stupid, so stupid. Why'd you do that? Ye What if, like, hitting that switch while a skeleton is standing on top of it launched the skeleton upward with immense velocity? Doesn't seem like there's really much of a penalty for death in this game. Kind of like, uh, Super Metroid. Besides, you know, resetting a bit of your progress. Ba -ba. Ba -ba. Didn't the guy just say... You can teleport back to the beginning of the dungeon with the mirror. I was, like, right there. It's like getting in your car to, like, walk across, to, like, go across the street. Um, so I guess... Start diving? So I'm just gonna start diving. Fuck it. Or, oh, I got the big key. Shit. That's just gonna put me there. I got the big key. I can open that door now. Uh, okay.
Wow. These guys are getting absolutely fucked, mate. Hmm. It's a weird switch. Does it have, like, Mario eyes? It kind of feels like it has Mario eyes. Ah! Ooh! Oh, thank you so much for that! Yes. Thanks. Okay, genuinely, thanks. They are throwing out the, uh... The puzzle solved jingle pretty fast and loose. Oh no. I need me some, like, potions. I need your strongest potions. Uh, I don't know what my favorite video is that I've made. No, I, I don't know. Oh, like so. It's hard for me to feel truly proud of the new Cuphead video, even though I think it's good. It has the it has the audio crackle in it. Sucks. Right. I actually need to press one of these buttons in order to do something. I actually forgot that I had made Scoop 3, and I had on my list written down, make Scoop 3. But no, this would be the fourth this year. I was thinking I might have to, uh, fall into the pits, because that's what you had to do in the, uh, Oh my god, in Link's Awakening, or something like that. That's something to do with, uh, falling down the pits. Maybe that was more of a penalty in that game. Oh, oh, I t <laughs> sometimes the hitboxes are a bit bigger than I thought they were. I was like, it just vanished. But no, it touched me. It, like, somehow brushed up against. That That's happened, like, several times now where I'm like, that's not gonna hit me, and then it does. They, like, scrape up against me. <laughs> Just give me a little time to think every time I swing my sword. <laughs> oh, that guy got yo. I kinda wish he spawned with full hearts. That'd be nice. Oh, the Portal- I didn't make the Portal 2 videos. I don't think those count. They're great. I didn't make them, though. Wow. Get fucked. Uh, I have... N I don't know if I've used the... RTC corruptor, as someone says. Which, I hate to be that guy, but that's kind of like saying ATM machine. Nothing wrong with it. <laughs> but, uh, technically something wrong with it, I guess. I, I think I did one stream... With, like, the Vine Sauce Corruptor. I don't know if it was RTC or not. I don't remember. But it, it wasn't terribly exciting. My corruption stream. Okay. I love how it's like, I, I can't tell if I've done this before or not. I think I haven't. I think it's just that it's a, there's a similar dungeon in Link's Awakening, which I have played more of. I hate you. I hate these worms. Gimme. Alright. You don't need to tell me the description of the item every time. That's that's something that's a little annoying about Zelda games. It's like Ocarina of Time. It like teaches you how to use bombs every time. Isn't that a thing? Fruit! An orb known as the Moon Pearl. No shit. Whoever holds the Moon Pearl is protected so that his form will not change in the Dark World. Yeah, I I know. 
Has this game not telegraphed that I need the thing in this dungeon enough? I mean, this is it's the only way forward, too. I feel like that's not something that had to be reinforced that many times. One of these guys is gonna get fucking obliterated by a pot. Oh! Excuse the hell out of me, they're too short. Are these like little spider dogs? Okay. Up, uh... Let's go in there, um... Don't suppose I can, like, leave a bomb out there? No, not really. Don't think bombs would activate that. Well, I'll do it later! Oh, is this a bumper? Yep, okay, well... <laughs> now I know, now I know what it is. Oh my god, Mario Bros. Fire Bars. <laughs> Oh, these guys are like little bumpers, too. Cheeky bitch. Any, anyone know what cheeky bitch is a reference to? Wow, this guy's tough. Is he actually taking damage? He's flashing. I just need to knock him into a pit, maybe. Oh, <laughs> that was the final slash. I <laughs> just hit the one where I was going to knock him into a pit. Okay. Um. Hmm. Oh, look at that. It's one of those tiles. Stop it! Stinky! Okay. Oh, there's a bombable. Oh, there's a couple bombable walls up here. Hello. Toy Story 2. Uh, nope, it's- oh, wait, what? Really? Okay. Wow. It's Revolution 9. What the fuck was that? Oh, here we are. Oh, shit. You know what? I'm gonna unabashedly use save states for this, because I remember this boss in Link's Awakening. And it was just a pain in the ass! It's just annoying. That's it. It's just annoying. So you know what? I'm gonna unabashedly... Actually, do I just need to knock it off? Fuck. I'm just gonna try hitting it with shit. I think I need to hit its tail, like, like exactly like the other one. I think the other one it was his head. Yeah, there we go. Ooh. Whoa, whoa. At least there's this one hole here. I feel like this hole actually helps a lot. See this picture of Hank? This will help a lot. It's stinky. I don't like this thing. Very much! Everything's bouncy in this fucking dungeon. I'm about to die. Let me shoot the thing. Oh! No. I need to accept my fate. Oh, he's going fast. Oh, he's going fast. Why did they think this was okay to put in the game? Oh, bouncing. Oh, that was it! God damn, I've been clutching out every boss. The beep has been happening. It has been present at every boss kill. Wow, I didn't actually have to... I didn't get bumped off at all. That was great. <sighs> Alright, you want to reinforce how much I need this Moon Pearl game? You won the Pendant of Wisdom. With this, you have collected all three pendants. Go now to the Lost Woods. <laughs> <laughs> he just went like, wow. Yeah, somebody earlier was asking, like, what Zelda games has he played? And the answer is quite a few. Uh, in fact, let me look at my list. Because <laughs> I've streamed... I had already previously played uh, Zelda's 1 and 2, but I streamed them semi-recently. 
Uh, I had played a little bit of this one up until like the very point that we're at right now, basically. Uh, previously, but no further. And this is otherwise, this is sort of a first time shindig with this one. And then I'm looking at my big list. Uh, so, Link Between Worlds, I have not played. I've played Breath of the Wild. Uh, I've played like 90% of Link's Awakening. I've played Majora's Mask, Ocarina of Time. I've not played Minish Cap. I have not played Oracle of Seasons or Ages. I have played Twilight Princess and I played Wind Waker. And I played a little bit of Phantom Hourglass, but I didn't really like it that much. Spirit Tracks and Skyward Sword I have not played, nor any of the uh, the spin-offs like Link's Crossbow Training, Tingle's Rosy Rupee Land, uh, or Hyrule Warriors, or any of those. So that's that's my history with the series. I've, I've done quite a bit, but not all of it. Yeah, nobody plays the Oracle games. Yeah. They don't they don't look super enticing, I'm gonna be honest, as somebody who doesn't really care for the uh things. Yeah, I haven't played Cadence of Hyrule either, uh nor have I played normal Crypt of the Necro Dancer. I didn't get the Pearl? Is that not what I just got? Really? That was a pendant, not a pearl. Well fuck me. Something just fell over in my room and made a noise and it scared the shit out of me. <laughs> I thought someone was in the room. Did I really not get the thing? That I need? What did I need to do? You can straight up tell me I did. Oh, maybe over here? Did I try this? Book. I need book for this. Pull up the Master Sword and you'll get the magic of ether. Great. <laughs> In that chest? I'm not sure which chest was that chest. Is the pearl something I can actually get right now or is it what, like the ether? I swear to god, if this is just a wild goose chase. This will reinforce my feelings towards, uh... Backseating tenfold. Was there really just a big-ass chest that I didn't open? Oh, good. You know what? Oops. I hit B on accident. I don't want to, like, waste my time. I was watching the Game Grumps, and they, they got stuck at the exact same point, where they didn't know what to do after they beat Lady Maria. Like, it, it doesn't make sense. Like, there's just a tiny, tiny little, like, random spot of the floor in the clock tower. It's like, yeah, obviously you go to the clock tower to use the, like, clock dial or whatever. But there, it's, you don't go to like the altar, you don't go up to her chair, it's just like, like three feet in front of her chair, there's like a little spot where there's like an activ activatable hitbox. It's just kind of weird. And there were like all the comments where people complaining about it, and I was like, I don't know, it's kind of a reasonable mistake to make. Because they did the exact same thing, they checked all the like reasonable places to check, and they were like, well, I guess it's not here. I guess we have to go somewhere else. Wow, there's a lot of blue- Whoa, the f What the fuck? I just said, whoa, the fuck. My cash here. Oh, right. Yeah, right here. Oh, I see. So I dropped down from the boss room above. Okay. And I guess... Fuck, which one should I have it, like, activated to? I guess... Oh, this one, so I can get out of there. I get it. Right? Probably? I don't know. I'm just winging it 90% of the time. Okay, so it wasn't, it wasn't like there was a big chest that was, like, easily accessible. It's just I forgot to go back for that. Um... 
What's with that switch on the floor? Oh, here. I think you're, like, low-key supposed to knock the red guy into the holes, even though you can technically kill him with damage. Drew. Drew. Okay, you're going in the hole. You're going in the hole. Oh, and I can actually get these pots now. Yeah, 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 yeah. Wow. That would have been useful. Oh my god. That is just straight up a fire bar from Mario. Here we go. Look at that. Yeah, it turns out the game didn't emphasize enough. It's another red ball! There's two red balls in this fucking tower. There's two magic red balls. All my guilt is gone. This protects the hero from changing the effect of the golden power. Orb game. Also, shit. Oh, shit, you know what? I'm going back. I'm doing it. Just so I can do that. Okay. And then I guess I'm just gonna use the mirror, so... <laughs> it's not even really a point to that. Alright, well, I, I did it. Now I can go get the Master Sword. Man, yeah, the, the, just, the most distinct memory is of wandering around on these very cliffs, endlessly trying to find the way forward. I don't think I ever realized that, like, the tower was, like, right there. That would have probably compelled me to think a little bit more about what was going on. Uh, shit. Let's just see. Two red magic balls in that one tower. Ridiculous amount. Moon Pearl will protect its bearer from the magical air of the Golden Land, so you can keep your human shape there. All I can do for you now is comfort your weariness. Huh. Alright, well, I made progress. Dunkey has talked about, like, Metroid moments in the past. Honestly, I've had more of that experience with Zelda games now. This is, like, tipped over the edge. I always have that shit where I'm like, what do I do? <laughs> ah! And it doesn't really feel very good just wandering around aimlessly forever, you know? This was not the way. Ha! Rock's feather. Ha! Yeah, so this is where I came from, but it's like a one way. I didn't realize I dropped down to get here, and it's the classic Pokemon gambit. Mm. People were abbreviating Link Between Worlds as LBW, and uh, for some reason I was thinking Link Breath of Wild. I was like, which one is that? What are you saying? Link Breath Wild? But then I realized what it was. Link Legend Breath Wild Zelda? What the fuck is my chat saying? Uh, where the fuck do I... Hmm. Do I have to, like, go into the dark world, I guess? I probably have to go to the dark world.
And I can't just do that with the mirror, can I? I don't think I can. The cave with the old man is the way out? Is that what someone's saying? Somebody has been telling me repeatedly to go to the cave by the ladder. I, I, was there a ladder there? I am going the same way. These caves, <laughs> man. These are fun. These are just a big old blast. Caves with keys. Okay, well, I guess I, I have not found a response. Here we go. This is a cave by a ladder. Still no word, but I'm assuming this is the one. Ooh. I remember this. Right, this is the one that lets you, like, drop down. Cool. Oh, thank you so much. Those crows suck so many cocks. They like, they always just leave when you hurt them. They need to like freeze one. I think they give you, whoa. I think they give you like a bunch of money and shit when you kill them. Neat. Well. Oh, is this the flute boy tree? Yo, fruit! I don't think it is. That was like way far away, right? Yeah. I've never been up here. Yeah, so someone said, I beat this area today. I had fun. I guess in response to me going, oh, what a cool area. And all I have to say to that is that the easily entertained are happy their whole lives. Oh, this is those guys' houses. Or this, this is those guys' home. Imagine, like, breakfast. God, living- having your bed be in the room with your, like, housemates, uh, like, with their sleeping quarters would be so horrible. Sleeping in the room with someone else that isn't, like, a significant other is just so, like, it's like anxiety. What if you have to, like, rip ass in the comfort of your own room and you, and you like, feel, like, uncomfortable doing it? Because there's a person right there trying to fucking, like, sleep. Ah, ooh. These electric goobs are, are, are real mean. Oh, it wasn't in response? Oh, well, never mind. I take it all back. I thought it was like a, um, I, for one, loved this area type thing. All right, well, time to get sword. The map is like is inaccurate. I guess it doesn't explicitly show like a closed off area there. It's like very slightly inaccurate. Oh, classic music. Oh. Do I have a fucking spider on my leg? No. <laughs> I thought I felt a spider on my leg. Okay, so I don't think I've ever done this. Are you friend or foe? Friend. Hey kid, this is secret hideout for a gang of thieves. Don't enter without permission. I really thought that was gonna be a, like a bad guy. I thought he was gonna start throwing spears Just like Bertha from Zelda 2 but they, they, That's not their name 
The ones that have like a weird feminine name. Well, hello, heart container. Hello. I lift up this huge fucking rock. Oh. Yeah. Hmm. Go in the thing. Oh, this is just like Ocarina. Ocarina had these. That's cute. And I know Ocarina came after this. Oh, that's an item. <laughs> this mushroom smells like sweet rotten fruit. You can give this to anyone who wants it. Okay. I don't even- I don't even know if I could tell you where I've heard this music. All I know is that I know every note. Oh, is that- That can't be the Master Sword in that shitty little dome. Oh, hello? It's gotta be like- gotta be like a mimic Master Sword. Hello? Oh, what the- You piece of shit! I just got mugged! How do I kill him? <laughs> he just shrugs it off. All right. Huh. Look at that layering. Look at the sprite layering. Oh, it's bad. He was holding it behind his head. Bad game. Legend of Smelda, a stink to the past. I am really happy to have that Cuphead video out, though. This little grove is shaped like an arrow, pointing forwards. I... Uh, God, I was just working on that for so long. So many hours of footage, that was like... Six streams worth of footage. Oh my god, I'm so fucking mad, mate. That's one situation, like, when enemies are just on top of you in these games. I'm always like... Oh. Sometimes you're, like, locked into multiple damage. Someone said they once played this game on their Game Boy Advance and asked a waiter at the restaurant what the text said when they got the Master Sword. That's, uh, that's a good story. Okay, um, this guy sucks. I hate this guy. He didn't even take a lot of money or bombs or anything. I just hate him. He's a piece of shit. This is fake Master Swords. Oh, hello. Oh, look at this. <gasps> the Woodland Critters. This must be it. Yeah. Oh, that's iconic. This can't be a fake, right? Is it gonna play them? Is it gonna play the one uh, that it plays in Ocarina? Oh, I need the book. The hero's triumph on Cataclysm's Eve wins three symbols of virtue. The Master Sword he will then retrieve, keeping the knights true. Line. Is that what it said? True line? Whatever. Yeah! It plays the same song! <laughs> That's so cool. I love the like slowed down majestic version of the da -da -da -da. That's cool. Suddenly, Sarasasala contacts you telepathically. This is like one of the most iconic scenes in like gaming history, right? Link taking out the Master Sword, am I crazy? I'm getting chills, even though it's just a little pixel guy. Fruit! It is extraordinary that you won the Master Sword that makes evil retreat. With this shining sword, I believe you can deflect the wizard's evil powers. The destiny of this land is in your hands. Please. Fruit! Wow, sick. Now I got it. Fuck yeah, my sword's actually pointy now! Holy shit, it's not just a block! Hell yeah. Oh, I love the little touch of the woodland critters too, that's nice. It's 
off-center, and it kind of was. Fruit! Help! Oh, the smog is gone. The soldiers are coming to Sanctuary. Aye! We are mumbo Should I murder this guy now? Master Sword, bitch. Nope. No murder today. Ba -ba -da -ba -da -ba. Ba -da -ba -da -ba. Oh, someone says like they can't wait for me to find out about the Super Metroid slash. Oh, look at that! I got the beam slash link to the past randomizer. I've known about that for quite some time. Part of the reason I'm playing this game right now is in preparation for theoretically doing that. So it's on my list. I don't think it's actually on the list. Uh, also, isn't there some weird shit that you can do with uh, with like the boomerang? And this is like a good place to do it. It's something to do with like, hold on. It's like that, right? Isn't that what you do? No. Shit, I don't even know. There's something you can do where you like throw the boomerang and you like make it go off screen and it like goes around the screen forever and like screen wraps. I need super boomerang? Oh, okay. Uh, also, shit, what was I even doing? Is it marked on my map? Oh, I need to go to the castle. What about talking to Sassafras, man? Hmm. Hmm. Yeah, asking what the grapefruit tastes like is a very common question, and I don't mean to devalue. Somebody said I want to ask that, but I'm sure it's been asked to death, and it, it in fact has. I even- there's an FAQ, if you type exclamation mark FAQ, I've actually answered that question on there, because I got it so much. Hmm. Well, alright. Can I access this from the side? I think I need to go down. Yup. Yup. Yup, 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 yup. Yup. Flower and grass placement in Breath of the Wild for the Master Sword area is the same as this game, but in 3D. I didn't know that. Did you hear that from Supper Mario Broth? That sounds like a Supper Mario Broth fact. It's like a Twitter account that posts interesting Nintendo factoids. Yeah, there have been mutterings recently of a uh, Switch port of Skyward Sword, although, as with any leak, don't get your hopes up. It's like one of those stupid, like, Amazon listing ones. It's not even worth it. It's like when you drop a penny. Those green rupees are like pennies. Where it's like, you don't even care. You're like, you're like, oh, this is just a pain just to like bend down and pick this up. Wow, that felt awesome. Charge right through the guard. Bash open the front door. Um... Does the color coloration continue into the fruit? No, it's red on the inside, just like all of us. Uh... Someone has suggested to me, Did you gaming? I'll have to check them out. I didn't, until now. Shit. Ah! I lost my beam! Hell yeah. Hop up 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 up. Uh... Okay. Am I- am I going the total wrong way? The marker was placed on the castle, although I could have sworn somebody said to go to the village. I just feel very aimless. Maybe, uh, the eye? 
Yo, the eye! Holy shit. Someone said, follow your heart, and I did just that. Wow, Pog. Massive Pog moment. These guys. It's one of these guys from the, like, dungeon. From Dungans Dungans. Dungans Dungeons. Hey, can you fucking shut up? Can... Are you done, my friend? Look at this guy. Look at this dude. Nice. You can't attack when you're in the doorway for some reason. Which keeps throwing me off. Give me a heart container. <laughs> nope. What was the point of that? What was the point of that chest just now? The locked door that's right there. Oh, I'm like ascending a spiral tower right now. Is that what's going on? Maybe not. You, you. Oh, give me that. I'm in a rat maze. It's like watching rats in a maze. Maybe I need to light the torches in here. They're they're in like awkward positions to light them, which makes me think it's like a puzzle. Oh come down here! You skunt. Shit. I want that. No, I want that. Whatever. Let me go through there. Thank you so much. I'm gonna start lighting these. Oh, poo on you. They have like a time limit, I guess, so I gotta be fast. Yahoo! No, I just need to go over there. <gasps> Sneaky. right now. I am I am not starved for rupees in the slightest. Can, I get a, can a man get a full heal before whatever boss, which is clearly coming, comes? Oh my god. You are quite the skunt, my friend. Ah. Right, I have the Hylian shield. I always forget about that in Zelda games. That you just- you can just like sit there and block shit. I played a tiny bit of Super Punch-Out. Just a little bit. The first like three or four guys. And half of them were just from the old games, so... I don't feel too bad. But there I had to figure out that you, by default, are blocking your gut. And one of the guys has this move that like alternates gut punches and face punches, and I was like, I can't fucking dodge it! I can't block the downward ones, I just duck. And then I looked it up and I was like, oh. I just need to sit there and do nothing to win. Anyone ever tell you that you have the Doom Guy's face? I've been told many things about my face. And about what character from pop culture I look like. Frequently Bobby Hill. That's the most common one. But Doom Guy, I can see it. I don't know, I'm like fat doom guy. <laughs> I 
Nice, fun, not awkward combat in the slightest. Listen well, fruit! Even with the Master Sword, you cannot inflict physical harm on the wizard. You must find a way to return his own evil magic power to a mirror. I gotta use the mirror, it's clearly the mirror, okay. Actually, that might not be the case. <laughs> Think about that scream Bobby makes. <laughs> I can't even come close to imitating it, honestly. It's a masterpiece of voice acting. I think possibly same voice actor as Pajama Sam, actually. I think that might be legit. I don't think I've ever checked, but they sound so similar. I can't imagine it's different, right? It's gotta be the same person. I'm okay, Dad. It's the fucking Butterfr- Butterfree! ba ha ha I can do a slightly- I can do a way better- Hank than I could ever do Bobby. Bobby, I need to have like that, yeah, that like little shitty kid voice. Oh god. Bo ho ho! Have a narrow urethra. <laughs> this is so. It's a battle of attrition. Right there. I learned that phrase recently. War of Attrition. It's just like, sheer display of power and nothing else. Oh, excuse? Oh, let me see. Nice! Yeah, and I guess, uh, fuck, did I say he er earlier? Yeah, Bobby Hill is voiced by a female, so... And apparently it's true. It's like one of those classic things. A lot of a lot of women voice, or a lot of ch child characters in cartoons are voiced by women. Fucking Popeye was voiced by a woman, by a woman, by a woman. That door had eyes. Oh, look at this. <laughs> Fruit. I have been waiting for you. <laughs> I was hoping I could make Zelda vanish in front of your eyes. Behold. The last moment of Princess Zelda. That's pretty fucked up to say. I'm just like a pink-haired furry kid. Ba 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 ba. Didn't they do this in the opening cutscene, or was it a different maiden? Also, that bed is horrifying. The mattress is tongues, and it's got teeth on either side. Ho ho ho! Merry Christmas! With this, the seal of the seven wise men is at last broken. He's gonna make her hymen vanish? That's disgusting. That's from the sick sock in chat, and you certainly are sick, my friend. I pity you. <laughs> it is now only a matter of time before evil power covers this land. After all, the legendary hero cannot defeat us. The tribe of evil, when we are armed with the power of gold. Ho, ho, ho. Now I must go, okay by Agafim from the Eye of Argon. Is this the Eye of Argon on the floor right here? Okay, well I just went up here and he was just like, well, you're just in time to see Zelda eat shit. Anything behind here? Oh! Pretty pog! Oh, shit. Oh, so, you mean to say you would like to be totally destroyed? Okay. Mirror, right? It's got a- nothing else can reflect anything. What? Huh? Oh, that just sent me back to the beginning. Fuck. Well... How is- it? Yeah, do I need the, uh, do I need the bug net? Is it just like... Or is that in Link to the- or is that in Link's Awakening? I feel like eating shit with the bug net was in that game, right? So... With my sword? Didn't the guy literally say your master sword will not be enough? You need to find a way to reflect his stuff back at him? I think I'll just do this. Can I go back far enough? Thank you. Oh god damn it. Okay, it's just like Ocarina. 
I don't know, didn't the guy say, like, literally that your Master Sword won't work and you need to find another way? Okay, well... Should be fine. So this is where this trope came from. I thought it originated from Ocarina of Time. I guess that's been kind of a common theme in this playthrough. Oh, hello, Orphan of Koss! Yeah, I know that's if you attack him directly, but did the guy actually say that? Or did he say your Master Sword? Whatever. I thought he just said the Master Sword won't be enough. A link to the Pong. Oh. Huh? Ice Beam. Yeah, I guess it's translated. Okay. Is that even gonna... There you go. Grug! <laughs> well met. Like the true hero that you are, but I'm not ready to admit defeat yet. I will draw you into the dark world. Speed! Oh. Oh, shite. Fruit! It is I, Sarasasasasa. I am communicating to you across the void through the telepathy. That place where you now stand was the Golden Land. But evil power turned it into the dark world. Oh, so heaven got fucked up, basically. The wizard has broken the wise men's seal and opened a gate to link the worlds. <gasps> At Hyrule Castle, he said it. In order to save this half of the world, the light world, you must win back the golden power. You must also... Okay, I'm writing this down. Seven maidens who Aghanim sent into the Dark Lord as members of the bloodline of the seven wise men they have powered it will surely help you. The maidens are locked in hidden dungeons full of evil creatures and dangerous traps. The Palace of Darkness should be your first goal in this world. Fruit I can rely on only you. This is a cool like pyramid. Please make this old man's wishes come true. Boil. Did a little cel celebratory boil. Oh, is that statues of Aghanim? Kind of looks like him. So now, I take it now the game is more fully open world. Like, I know it's similar structure to Zelda 1, where you just go to whatever dungeon you want, and just fuck around. So I'm gonna do that, until the game tells me not to. Have we heard this in the game yet? Oh, fuck off! Really? Uh... I don't know, all these songs so far I have just known already. Uh, I gotta say, I a lot of quests all the time, that is another one of the most commonly asked questions is, will you play Gungeon? I gotta say, besides Isaac, I'm not huge on games like Isaac. <laughs> I know that may sound weird and picky, but uh, I don't know, I, I still might check it out someday, but I'm not hugely eager to do so, especially because I know it's gonna be like a streaming nightmare. Because everyone's gonna be like, no, do that! You know? Oh, this tree is gross looking. That, that looks like something out of, uh, we were talking about the Mario and Luigi games. That looks like something out of uh, Partners in Time. The Shroobs. I could always hide chat. But I like having a contact with the outside world and not just feeling like I'm talking to myself for two hours. That is always an option. Alright, well this way to the Palace of Darkness doesn't get more clear than that. Actually, fuck, was the arrow pointing this way? Shit! Guess it needed to be clearer, huh? Oh, you ogre. Oh, you ogre. Sorry, Oga. This way, yeah. That was an awful joke, I'm sorry. <laughs> <gasps> Oga Nobunaga. Hmm. 
Hmm. Oh, look at that. Okay. I guess that's where I'm going. Okay, cool. <laughs> I was already going this way. Beep -ba -ba. Ba -beep -ba -ba. What is your favorite food? Right now, it's dried apples. <laughs> Been eating the shit out of those. Hello, my friend. You're new here, aren't you? Did you come here looking for the power of gold? If that bomb wall doesn't actually open, I'm gonna be real mad. Well, you're too late. It will only obey the first person who touches it. Okay, and clearly, Aghanim got it. I came here because of greed for the golden power, and look what happened to me. Well, I have the moon pearl. To restore the golden land, a person worthy of the golden power must defeat the man who created this place. Until that time, I'm stuck in this bizarre shape. Okay, yeah, uh-huh, Triforce, yeah, wow, the word Triforce showed up, finally. Skulls have now replaced pots, okay. <sighs> okay, oh, I need to go up there. That wasn't even the real Dungan. There's lots of enemy variety so far. Just been tons of different shit. Although I figure there will come a point where I will start to see stuff. Oh, look at this. Do I need to, like, transform on here? Bah, oh. Okay, I guess that wasn't, strictly speaking, necessary. Oh, but I, I need to... Huh. Because I can't go back... I can't just use the mirror to go back, and I think... Yeah, that's only in the Dark World. So, can I talk to... Is Sarasasas in here? Is this where he was? Oh, let's find out. I don't remember what this was. Oh, this was... Oh, I've already done this. I've already done this. I'm backing out. It's faster than using the mirror. Uh, okay. Well, I need to go touch the thing. Did I just spawn on top of an enemy? That was cool. Someone, someone was saying that the uh, they like how the hearts fall like petals. It is kind of neat, but it always makes it look like it's a half heart. I always thought when they're falling, they look like a half heart. And then when they land, they look like a full blood for some reason. Oh, look at that. Oh, but I can't go up there. Shit. Boy! Well, god damn it. <laughs> oh, a fairy. Do you have, like, bottles in this game? Gotta be, right? Also, that's... Well, that's annoying. There must be some way to get up there. Ooh! There's fucking, like, Yodas on this- on these, like, statues. Fuck off! Oh, I was trying to hit that bird! The birds really fucking suck. In this game. It's just like the crows. Oh, god damn, I'm all the way back up here. It's a little annoying. Birds are assholes in this game. Oh, hello! Don't have a lot of health. Oh, I could have just gone right over here. Uh, hmm. Okay, well, there must be there must be some way into there. Yahoo! Bop, 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 bop. 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 Bop,
Is this even where I- yeah, okay. Biddle ba ba beep ba ba beep ba Gimme. Oh god damn it, this is like a total Pokemon thing where it's like I could totally just like turn sideways and fucking squeeze through there. Well, that's sad. That was my one lead, except for somebody bitchily telling me to look for an arrow. Those are like Donkey Kong statues. Oh, it's like Earthbound. Perspective is a strange thing. Nothing? What the fuck is that? Why that shadow got a bulge? Oh, okay. This <laughs> is weird. Stood out quite a lot. It's, uh... One of the things, one of the reasons why I always seem uh, bitter about backseating is... People basically never tell you in a way that isn't like... Ugh! How do they not know? Oh my... Oh, it's Kiki the monkey. How do they... Oh my god! Oh! And it's just... It, it exhausts me. Uh, sure, I've got like a billion rupees. It's th that's the thing that really gets me. This is also straight out of Earthbound. The ones that always get me are the ones that are like phrased as though I'm not supposed to read them, but I'm clearly supposed to read them. If you give me 100 rubies, I'll open the entrance for you. Oh shit, am I gonna have to go back and get him? God damn it. Ugh. Let's try the mirror. I'll just go back, I don't even care. Uh, oh. <laughs> oh, but this is just the, okay. Uh, yeah, okay. Let's go back, go back. Go back to pre-monkey. Do it. Is he just gonna fuck off? Is he just gonna leave? Oh. For a second, I thought he was just gonna ditch with my money. Alright. Oh, this has gotta be Helmo Rock King. Yeah. I like boomerang it and then hit it from behind. I have, uh. Oh! I have seen a lot of the bosses from this game before, and this one's kind of iconic. I thought it was coming earlier because I saw statues that I thought looked like it, but then I saw those statues in every temple. Okay, hello. See, why wasn't that? What the fuck is with that sound? It seems like they just randomly... Open it! They just randomly interchange that with, uh... I push this. Tug. Do you ever just give a tug, folks? Um... Okay, that was a fun passage. Also, what is the point of that switch? What is the point of that? Okay, I guess... sure. The little mini Helmer rocks are pretty adorable. They're fire crabs, they're fire crabs from fucking Harry Potter. Okay. One way? Don't shoot me again. Wabada habada habada hoodah habada. Ah! 
Oh, this isn't gonna crumble. Oh, it isn't. Okay, cool. <laughs> cool. What the fuck was up with that ground? It was like, oh, I'm gonna do it. Is this... Oh, look at that! Oh, <laughs> it's like the... It's like Rock's Feather, but it's kind of situational. Well, I did it. So what the fuck is up with that? Maybe I like fall from like a higher height. Maybe I like drop an anvil onto it. Get over there before all these guys join the party. I don't want to get bumped around like crazy. Hobbit! Woo! Let's put you back here. All right. That's. Uh, that's okay. Yeah. There were even similar puzzles in that avatar. Game Boy game. Oh shit. With like the switches, hitting switches and doing like Zelda-esque puzzles. Starting to think if this was quite a big inspiration for that game. Weird. Are there scripted item drops in this game? Because it feels like some of them are random and some of them are scripted. Oh! Oh, I need to weigh it down. I was like, what the fuck? Here we go. I thought I was just somehow, like, activating and deactivating it over and over. Simultaneously. Oh, look at- Oh, look at these guys! A little bit of Binding of Isaac. I always knew those N Nintendo guys were hack frauds that rip off indie games. Hey, hey bro. Hey, bro. Oh my god, he shoots fire. Wait, how do I kill him? Wait, how do I kill him? Huh? Suck my dick! Suck my dick! Wait, what? <laughs> there must be something. Bombs, maybe? Is it the spin attack? Literally fucking huh if it's the spin attack. Literally fucking huh if that's actually what it is. Like actual textbook by definition huh. Textbook, huh? Ooh. 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 Oh my god. I'm gonna be so mad if it turns out this is actually what it is. Oh god, I gotta do this whole thing again. There's another classic staple of, of Zelda games, is pushing big shit. Alright, let's just see the, like, let's see if this works. Nope. Okay. <laughs> Funny joke? I don't know. Uh... God, I don't know. Him in the back? Why was everybody saying spin attack then? Oh, I see. I was like, what? 
God, people are terrible at giving advice. Oh god, this sucks. This sucks! Wait, this sucks! How do I fucking do this? He shoots me! <laughs> Wait, were you guys just guessing? Like a thousand people just guessed at once the same thing? Like fucking like bees? Like fucking ants? You just got like the pheromone signal? <laughs> okay. <laughs> Thank you, LTTP. How to kill impossible red guy. Oh wow, it auto-corrected. Arrows, it's literally what I was trying to do and people told me to spin attack them. Holy fuck. Do you see now why I don't listen to backseating? It's literally what I was trying to do! <laughs> you guys are idiots! You guys are idiots! Oh my god! Fucking morons here! What the fuck? Huh? They just guessed. Just guess. And then just, I guess, like, follow the herd. Oh, hello? I need to, like, eat him? Wow. That's kind of a fun puzzle. That was, you know, sometimes chat tries to cover up their own idiocy with jebated. That was one million percent not jebated. That is chat attempting to cover their own tracks. <laughs> oh, I need the hammer for this. How do I know? That must have been a thing in Link's Awakening as well, the hammer, right? Yeah, let's smack this. No, I can't even go over that. Chat debated themselves, exactly. Oh wait, hold on, there must be something I can do in here. Maybe I just... I, I'm, I'm waiting for the mushroom to come up. Uh, okay, yeah, there's really not much I can do here, it seems. <laughs> come on! Give me a fucking break. That's all. Just give me a break. I don't see how, uh, or wait, maybe I can shoot these guys, too? Also, even the fact that, uh, those guys can literally only be damaged by arrows doesn't make any fucking sense. Where's their big eye? Where's their big eye? Tell me this. Oh, right. Maybe I need to bomb. Shit. <laughs> but that won't even do anything, right? I'm assuming, yeah. Okay. Okay, well. Yeah, hey, listen, there's people saying, oh shit. Am I soft locks now? <laughs> Is that- oh, fuck off. It's the same exact buttons to access this menu that it is to access the other menu. You just have to like- it's like quick press versus hold. I, I feel like that- oh yeah, I could use the mirror to get out of there. Oh, fuck off. Oh, fuck right off. I'm always mixing up A and B. Okay, well that was just a fucking dead end, I guess. I just felt like I was making such progress and then there was just nothing to do. I, I might need the hammer. Maybe that's the item in this dungeon? Oh, uh, no? I'll have to bounce myself across with such force and ferocity. 
and I land on the other side. It's a one way thing. How do I how do I stomp my feet up and down on the ground? Is this accessible? No. I can drop down there. Oh! Oh! Well, let's try both of those things. Hello! Wow, lots of bones. Oh, fuck off. Eemini, 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 eemini. What is this? Another dark world tile? Heh. No, it's just gonna take me back to the beginning of the dungeon. The fuck do I do there? Okay. Uh, neat. Okay, well, clearly something. Oh, what? Step all over? Did I not step all over? Did I not step all over? That's my question. Did I not like walk all over it? <laughs> all over the whole thing? And now we're back here. Fucking brilliant. <laughs> did, I, did I not step on it though? Did I, did I not literally do that? Like, I guess that's one way. Okay. So there's still unexplored paths. But I don't think I can. Can I get to any of those? I might need to go, like, into the overworld and find. whatever activates these things. I think it's a hammer. Oh, look at that. Oh, ba -ba -ba -ba. Ew. oh, and if I go in there, I see. If I go in there while the switches are switched, then it'll switch. Uh, I don't know how to get up there. Okay. I'm glad that's not like a 10 hour long cutscene like it is in Luigi's Mansion. Boy, oh, Demon Monkey Room. It's me, Zelda. I'm locked in Turtle Rock on top of Death Mountain. Okay, I'll try. I'm trying my darndest. Ah. Okay, is that this? That's the whole room? Okay, cool. Very cool. What the fuck, what the fuck was this room? What? Is this not where I went? No, I went down the middle path. Okay, so I already checked down there. I'm going in here, right, with the switch turned. Yahoo! There you go. I was able to use my massive brainular in that moment to solve the puzzle. Ye oh my god, what? And these are falling? Excuse me? These are the ones that are falling. No, for real though. Those are the ones that are falling. And not the clearly about to fall ones earlier. Huh? Okay. Let's check what's over here. Compass. Oh, and look at this. Multiple paths. Wow. 
Wow. Okay. Sure, yeah. Yeah, gimme. I'll take it. <laughs> that was good shit. I liked that room. Oh, I still like that. I'm continuing to like this room. This room is great. Is that a button? No. Love this room. I'm at 994. Pretty sure the limit is 999, but I'm not sure. Okay, if that floor crumbles under me, I'm gonna flip out. Okay. This is uh, the world's hardest game. You remember that piece of shit? Remember that stinker of a game? Cool. Uh... Was there anything else up here to do? Or was that really it? Did it all just loop around? God, I guess it kind of did. What are those tiles? Oh, um, wait, what the fuck were those tiles on the map? Oh, that's the big chest, I think. Oh, thank you. Thank you for walking. Little guys are scrotes. Oh, stop that. Oh, stop it, you! Here we go. It's gotta be something. Big chest. Oh, I don't have the big key. That's very sad. That's very, very sad, because I'm going to have to come all the way back here. <sighs> okay. Okay, I'm just going to mirror out. Fuck it. Big! What are people talking about? People talking about a game? Oh, the, the right. Cuphead is harder than that piece of shit. People were saying like all sorts of stuff and I was like, what game are you talking about? Hardest game ever, right. Yeah, that was the thing. It wasn't really that hard of a game. It was just a boring piece of shit. Like I got a comment on the VOD that had that game in it at one point where somebody was like, oh, Grapefruit's such a pussy. He couldn't even do basic pattern memorization. And I was like, no, that's, that's exactly why that game is doo-doo. It's because it is just basic pattern memorization with no window dressing whatsoever. With no personality or anything. It's like you, just, you shouldn't be proud of that and like bragging that your game is devoid of all charm. Yeah, the game was hard because it was long and boring. That's exactly right. It's, it's hard because nobody would want to finish it doesn't necessarily mean, mean that you've made a compelling challenge. This is fun. Oh. oh shit. I didn't mean to do that. I'm just gonna keep doing this. Until it dies. Fuck it. You know, I got a tirade of comments once explaining to me that none of the mistakes that I made in, uh, or none of, like, the deaths in Super Mario 63 were anything but my fault. Any error was only on my, on my part, and the game was, was infallible, and I think we can all agree that that was the truth. Um... Great. 
Hold on. Is this the room I was thinking of? Yeah. So I want the other entrance to this, but I can't... I can't get there. I have to get there from the other side. But I don't know how to do that. Mmm... <laughs> Hmm. Well, this warrants more exploration, I guess. This guy. Stop around. Vomit, maybe? Oh, fart noise in disbelief. That's clearly a fall through floor. How is that a bomb it? Come on. Uh, does Super Mario 63 feel bad to play or does it just look like that? I mean, in my honest opinion, it felt pretty shit. It was just, it was, it's kind of like if you've ever played Sonic 06, where it just feels like you don't have much control over what's happening. You know? Big! Okay. Heads. What are all those heads? Look at that! What did I do wrong earlier? I don't understand. Okay. Okay. I'm not mad. Yeah, in Super Mario 63, very impressive for a, a Flash game, of course. And it had many remarkable qualities. It was just that, uh, overall, as an actual video game, compared to other real video games, didn't fare super well. But it was cool, it was cool. Sort of like remixed a bunch of different aspects of the like Mario series. So now I gotta go up to the big chest again, okay. I'm gonna get this basic like early beginner for babies dungeon. I'm gonna get it, I swear. Oh, and look, this is sealed back up. The floor is red blood cells. Did a lot of work. Uh, is the switch switched, or is it not? Oh shit, I keep accidentally placing bombs. Oh, you... I think it's not switched. Yes. So I need to go flip the red switch, and then yeet back to the beginning. Like, there were plenty of interesting things about Mario 63, it was just... Many Flash games, even good ones, are plagued by bad controls. Oh, this is not the way to go. If I can portal the Flash version, I had a ton of nostalgia for, and then I played it and I was like, man, this game kind of controls like ass. But, uh, but it was still, it was still a fun little blast from the past. But it was just a blast from the past that controls like ass. Oh! That's a fun little encounter, just a little enemy on the on the bridge where you can't really hit him from behind, so you're you're probably gonna knock him off. Okay, back to this fun room. But man, when I got those comments on that video that were like, oh man, what a wuss, you wouldn't even do the hardest game, and I'm like, oh my god, you're the kind of person that that game would sucker in. Oh my god! Also, I am very low on health. Okay. It's the hammer! Wow, that hammer looks like a little piece of shit. It's just very nondescript. Okay, nice. 
You can use it to pound on other things too, if you know what I'm fucking talking about. Oh look, that's just on a timer, I guess. I thought it was triggered by walking onto the floor. Okay. Um, so now I have this. Yee! Wow, it still looks like a little piece of shit. Okay, so where was that? Fuck. Uh, I, I remember, I remember, I remember where to go. I remember where to go. I remember where to go. Give me a heart, please. I got a baby's playset hammer. <laughs> okay. Well. That's good. It made the beeping go away. Oh, I can just smash skulls with this hammer? Hell yeah. I'm all about bashing heads. I'm all about busting balls. <laughs> I'm not. I'm really not. I, I want to reiterate. I gotta do this whole shenanigans again. It's probably a more efficient way to do this. the more efficient way is just to like <laughs> jump onto the fucking thing. Go past it. So those are the kinds of things I can hit with the hammer, I'm pretty sure. Were those in Link's Awakening or do I just know that through like osmosis? I think I may have like watched a playthrough of this game ages ago. And that's how I know all the music and like am remembering all these things, but only faintly. Okay, yeah, of course not literal osmosis. It's information, not water. You know what I mean? That's a, isn't that a thing people say? Learning something through osmosis? Just joking around, of course. I'm only slightly angry about that. Time for the moment of truth. <laughs> Flat fucks. Oh, and that's how I kill these. Interesting. All right. I wish there was like a quick. Is there like a quick switch of items in this game? I kind of feel like there isn't. Oh shit. Ah, I don't want to fucking warp back out. There's really not much else to do here. Is there like a secret in the wall? No? I need another key. Okay. Well, fuck, I don't know where the next key is. Huh? Hmm. Like there was one other chest, but it was up in a place where I couldn't reach. I'm very confused. Fall near the chest with the moles near it? Oh. I don't remember this. Moles? <laughs> I don't remember a single mole in this video game. Um. 
I don't suppose I can't reach up there, no. Like that's the only place I can that I haven't probed. Is there like a bombable wall up here that I just missed? No. Mmm. Anyone know what I have to do here? I'm pretty stumped. I feel like I've gone everywhere. That I can go. I don't know. Wall in the ape room. I don't even know where the ape room is. Mm -hmm. Oh, I gotta go fucking do this again. Is this... I should just warp out. I should just warp out. This is a dead end. Uh, was it over here? It was one of these. I think. Room. Great. <laughs> Thanks. That one is not pushable for some reason. The other one is. I do not know why. Okay, it must be the other side. Oh, fuck you. Ape room, this is ape room. Oh, look at that. Yeah, wow, I missed that. Put two bombs for good measure. Wow, okay. Yeah, well, thanks for saying that, because I would have been stuck there for like 10 fucking hours in that little Metroid moment. Where it's just like you missed a tiny thing in some random room. Go fuck yourself. So that's the kind of advice I do appreciate. Great. Guys, what do I do for these enemies, huh? What do I do for the red guy, huh? Well, these guys are... significantly more juicy! Try that hole in the floor, but I got distracted with this. What is this? What am I walking on right now? Oh, it's treadmills, I see. It's like a waterfall of like sludge. <laughs> Here we finally are. Oh, the map. Didn't even realize I didn't have that yet. Okay, nice. Feels like we're drawing to a close. Which is good, because I'm I'm done with the stream after this. Sometimes those cracks in the walls connotate a, a bombable thing, and sometimes they don't. Bombs! Oh, look at that. Fairy fountain. Whoa. Secret fairy fountain. Alright. That's good. Uh, yeah, sure. Uh, is there even a point in going up that way? Or I guess I have a key now, huh? Yeah. There absolutely is a point. That is the point. <laughs> that is the entire point. Sip of water. I am enjoying this. I, I've been expressing frustration, but uh, it's fun. 
I still kind of stand by not caring for the 2D Zeldas as much as the 3D Zeldas, though. Like, I definitely feel justified in my pre-established opinion. Okay, give me the give me the arrows. It's it's kind of fun fighting these guys. Once you know what to do, if there are not people leading you astray. What do you think of the new Sam and Max? How new are we talking? I have no idea. Sam and Max face the music. I don't know why I keep navigating the menus like that, by the way. I don't need to do that. I just keep doing it. Oh, can't even knock him back. Without the hammer. Boom! Someone earlier was saying that having the turtle enemy right next to the uh, the guys that you hammer down was good design, and I agree. It was a teaching, teaching moment. They get faster as their numbers decrease. Possibly not. Oh, can you fuck off? Oh, can you fucking fuck off, please? Fuck! Oh! Did you just see him walk right over that candle? Or that, like, torch? That would have killed me if I had not been actively running away from him. In preparation for jank. Cool. Um. Oh, of course. That one. Well, I, I don't know about the new Sam and Max. I have never played the series, but I'm sure it'll be funny, as those games are known for being. Oh my god! Wow, those guys are kind of annoying, actually, even with the hammer. Because if you don't hit them with the tiny, 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 tiny little hammer hitbox, then they just flip right back up and jump onto you. But like shockingly annoying enemies for what they are. I guess I could probably just use my sword when they're upside down. Um what do I have I going there? Okay. Oh god damn it, I gotta do this whole fucking thing again. Mmm. See what see what I'm saying about the 2D Zeldas? I don't know, I don't feel this feeling as often in the 3D ones. Especially like Wind Waker and shit. Twilight Princess. It's just, this is a very common feeling of like, oh great. <laughs> in these 2D ones. That's the exact sentiment. Oh great. This. I gotta fucking do this. <sighs> just to get in there. Might as well get these. At least the game does strategically give you hearts at good moments. Huh. I gotta do all this again? God damn. Yeah, that's pretty annoying. It's just like, get me back to the part that I died on, please. That is just brutal. <laughs> that is such a weak sound for that thing bouncing around. Tink. <laughs> See, I could just do that. It kind of makes like a shock wave. 
Oh god damn it. Ugh. Never never ready with the hammer there. Yeah, yeah. Okay, oh right, I have to fight a trillion of these guys. See why'd I do that? That was the least efficient way to do that. Oh come on. And little little frustrations like that just always mount up for me. There we go, that's way easier. With like not being able to like move properly and shit. Okay, that's way easier though. Okay, any more? Who's left? Fuck you in the asshole! Holy fuck! <laughs> and like, what was the point of that room? It's just like a puzzle that you will instantly solve? Or be stuck and go search for the solution elsewhere? Okay. Helmorock King, it's gotta be, right? Yep. Do I smack his face? Or do I just have to hit his weird tail? Oh god. Oh god! Oh, look at that! Ah! I am not gonna have enough health for this, my friends. Oh, what's this? What's he doing? Okay. What? Huh? What? Okay. That was weird. I guess you have to do like a bunch of hits on his hammer. See, now I have to do all that garbage again. Like, fuck that. So much. Oh, god damn it. Ugh. See, this is exactly the sort of annoying shit in these games. Where I'm just like, come on. It's like, ugh. Oh. Now this is like the next 20 minutes of my life is the next attempt at this boss because I have to do all this garbage again. I don't know, it just feels like there was like a lack of thought put into it. Just let me through. Ugh. Great, and now there's no point in doing that. Because I need to have all my health. God, what? This is a very annoying dungeon. I guess I'll just do this, because I gotta play it safe, because I gotta have all my health for the boss. This is what fun is, right? It just, it feels hindered, you know? It feels like this game is, like, held back. Maybe you should have caught those fairies you found, just, like, in my hand. Or in the bottle that I don't have. Okay. Now I'm going to be going back Rewinding to this point from this from this point further because I don't want to do this nonsense over and over Oy vey You shouldn't make that noise while playing a fun game. Ugh. But you do sometimes. Even in the good ones. Okay. Go down there. Go all the way down. It's it's funny. It's funny. Because I'm thinking, I'm, the words of Aaron Hansen are echoing in my head about having to wait so much, and it's like, this really isn't any better than waiting in Ocarina of Time, you know? It's just like, ugh. 
I'd take waiting over busy work. Like, puzzle that I've already solved before, you know? Oh, yes, yes, dude, yes. Love this room, bro. Oh, I love how the fire doesn't fucking function, bro. Unless you're on the fucking, like, pixel. It's like, I go back now. I go back because of that. I don't want to waste my fucking time. This game is clearly dead set on having happen, anyway. Oh my god. Oh fucking K. Uh. <laughs> okay. Just in case I go too far, I'm gonna do this. Cause honestly, fuck that to the ends of the earth. Oh shit. Wrong button. I don't understand. Okay, I. Hit it once, and then never again? Uh, okay. Welp, I'm glad I made the save state. Huh? <laughs> the hammer works on it once, and then never again? Oh, shit. Wow, I just did that. So go back. What? Oh, like what? Do I do? The, the item worked on him exactly one time. Oh, okay. Cool. <laughs> it takes a few hits, all right. It's taken quite a, quite a lot of hits, in fact. It's taken about, like, ten hits, I'd say. Um... Wow, I hate this. <laughs> I hate this. No, it took, like, ten hits before I reset it. What the fuck? Oh, fuck right off! Oh, this game sucks! Oh, this game sucks dick! No visual feedback on that whatsoever until like 10 hits later. Oh, this game sucks ass. What the fuck, game? There you go, now I can fight the boss. It's, 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 what, the, what the fuck were they thinking? No visual feedback, it looks like it's glanced off. You'd search for other solutions unless you have a chat right here. What a dumb boss. It's more auditory, tink! That is the sound of it doing nothing. That was some nonsense. I hope this game gets better from this point on, because this dungeon was poopy. It was poopy. Oh, and now we get the princess who talks to us for 10 minutes. It's Zelda's theme. Fruit! Because of you, I can escape from the clutches of the evil monsters. Thank you. This world used to be the golden land where the Triforce was hidden. But because Ganon, you were the boss of thieves. <laughs> He's the mafia boss. Wished it, wished it, huh? Wished it the world was transformed. Hmm. Sooth. I'm sure he's intending to conquer even our light world after building this power, his power here. 
He is trying to open a larger gate between worlds near the castle using our powers. But the gate is not open completely yet. If the seven maidens come to the gather, you can break the barrier around Ganon's hiding place. I will tell you where the other girls are held. I believe you will destroy Ganon. I will return to my original form at that time. A frog. She was a frog. Yes. May the way of the hero lead to the Triforce. Yay! Alright, well, I did the Donkey Kong dungeon. Many trials and tribulations. God, that was just miserable. But alright, I'm out. I did it. Time to go die. No, I'm gonna go like, buy some shit before I end the stream. Is Mkiki gonna be here? Yeah, I think I see him. Monkey. No? Oh, never mind. Really? Oh, I thought I saw him in there. Okay. Must have been the pink of Link's hair. No, of course. Just preemptively. Sometimes when I am highly disappointed by the actions of a game at a certain moment, I will say, this game sucks. Uh, please, for the love of God, don't take that as an assessment of the entire game. Oh my God. That guy's just happy to be here. He got hit by me and he was like, time to take out a bomb, baby. Oh my God. Okay. Not even really a point in picking up rupees at this point. Uh, maybe I should use that mirror, huh? Make it a little easier on myself. Uh, what if you took damage from crashing into shit? You just die from using the Pegasus boots. Okay. Uh, I'm gonna go... I'm gonna go to the village. Let's do it. Kakariko Town. Whee! Fuck, is it this way? I, I keep having to check the map. That's uh, in Hollow Knight, when they had the ability to just whip out the map at any time, even when you're walking. That shit is so good. Also, yes, I did say when you're walking. Because look how often I check the fucking map. I don't know. Well, I got the Master Sword, and I beat the first dungeon, which I think the rest of the dungeons are now marked on my map? No, they are not. Also, I've gone the wrong way. Also, now that the Cuphead glitch hunting video is out, can probably start it finally getting around to doing that Pokemon Generation 1 glitch hunting. Because those games are filled with glitches. To the brim. Oh, would it show them on Dark World? Okay. And I would need to go back and find my little, like, puddle of sparkles, right? To go to the Dark World? Well, that's kind of fucked. Alright. Well. Mm, see, like that, like that, that was the exact kind of situation I was talking about earlier. Where you get like locked into extra damage and it's just like, well, fuck. I like can't move fast enough to avoid this. It's like when an enemy overlaps on you and it's like you don't have time to charge your little run. You don't have time to actually just walk away. Just take two hits. Um... Eat dick. Alright. Uh, so I, I guess just let's try some houses. Chickens! Cuckoos. Cuzcos. Okay. Is there anyone above this? It'll probably have a, uh... 
probably have like a shop icon of some sort, right? Grassy knoll. Hmm. Are you the shop? Okay, thank you. God, every, nobody's here. Everyone's out. Does that say shop? Mm, this is the flute guy's dad. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. Hmm. Well, this is a very enticing NPC village to explore. Where there's like jack shit to do. Oh, here we go. Oh, but this is... They don't even have the bottle here. Fuck it. Huh? Oh, fuck you. Where do I get the fucking bottle? Which building? I've gotten like 10 and they're all like empty. Sure. Oh, thank you, thank you, thank you. This fucking one. Bottle guy is outside. Okay. I have not seen any guys. I I'm sure I've probed every fucking like inch of this place except the one place where the guy is because I haven't seen any guys. And I've gone all over this village. Oh, here we go. Oh, I think I did glimpse this guy, actually. You, sir, have you been going through life without one of my hold anything bottles? Sure. Why did you just play the low health sound? Now hold it above your head for the whole world to see. It's good for business. That was a cute little meta joke. Can I get another one? Give me like ten. Oh, fuck off. I have so many rupees. Give me like a thousand. Yep, yep. Yep, yep. I don't even know. Is this the one? Boom, 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 boom. Gimme. Alright. Cool. Uh, you know what? Might as well. I'm splurging. Oh, okay. Alright, well, that's it. That's it for today. I got a bottle. And I, I beat the one dungeon. Uh, I guess, god. Oh, that's such a pain in the ass that you have to go get the little sparkle to be able to use the dream world. There must be another way. There's, there must be like some confessor gin type stuff that you can do to get that back, right? Something like that. Uh, but yeah, that's that's it for today. I will continue to play. Hopefully that was just a little dip in quality and a little peak of frustration. Because uh, otherwise, oh man. <laughs> but no, I, I did have fun. And, and thank you for watching, guys. Uh, catch you next time. Just spin to kill the guy.